Okay, in 2003, 2004, 2004, yeah, 2004, I, I began to desire God. My hunger for God began to, you know, become a lot more uh, heavy or heavier. It became heavier. And one of the things that really changed my life was an instruction the Holy Spirit gave to me. I believe the Holy Spirit communicated this to me. And he said, go and buy all the books of Kenneth Hagin and begin to read them. Hmm. I went into a bookstore and bought all the books of Kenneth Hagin. I bought Believer's Authority. I read it. I bought The Spirit Upon the Spirit Within. I read it. I bought um, Plans, Purposes, and Pursuits. I read it. I bought I Believe in Visions. I read it. I bought The Midas Touch. I read it. I bought um, Triumphant Church, his book on deliverance. I read it. I bought um, The Art of Intercession. I read it. I bought The Healing Anointing. I read it. I bought Understanding the Anointing. I read it. I bought Love the Will of Victory. Man, I was copiously consuming Hagen. I was copiously consuming Hagen. And after that, guess what? My fight, my hunger went off the roof. Wow. Guess what? I was just, I felt I could do anything. And what happened after that was that before that time, I didn't feel like reading the Bible. But after reading all the books of Kenneth Hagin and how he will analyze and draw revelation from the Bible, I now began to feel like reading the Bible. I felt like strong meat, no more milk. Because when you are reading books of anointed men of God, that's like milk. Or when you don't feel like reading the word of God and you now have to use a devotional, that's milk. But when you go for the raw word itself, that is strong meat, you know. So I went from milk to strong meat. So please... If you are struggling or you want to go deeper in your spiritual life and you are not enjoying the word of God, I want to recommend to you, if it appeals to you, go and read all the books of Kenneth Hagin. After that, guess what I did? I began to read all the books of Benny Hinn. I read Understanding, the, I mean, The Anointing. I read Good Morning, Holy Spirit. I read Welcome, Holy Spirit. I read Biblical Road to Blessing and it was a blessing to me. Just amazing books. That book, Benny Hinn, The Anointing, is a book I will never forget in my life. In fact, that book... Because in that book, Kenneth Higgins says that the key to the anointing is crucifying the flesh. And the key to crucifying the flesh is play, praying in the spirit. I, will, I, I mean, that took my praying in the spirit to a whole nother level. A whole nother level. So please. Then I did the same thing for Miles Monroe. And you know, that's how your spiritual life. Just find icons and copiously consume their literature. Find icons and copiously consume their literature. That's it. I hope this works well for you. Do have an amazing day. Bye for now.